Well, that's not good. I don't know when that happened. It either happened on my birthday or shortly before and I was too knackered to know or we got another one burned out and I can't ever get any anymore, so. Yeah, it's just gonna die and I don't know what the fuck I'm gonna do. Figures. But anywho, we just had Jay's bar. We'll get back to that in a minute. Or not really, I mean, everything's kind of the same as it was, but everything else is a problem. Place is a wreck. The table was all nice and clean. But the most important thing is it's here. It is here, finally. We got it. Now, I have to figure out what the fuck I'm gonna do as far as getting this working. Now I got things temporarily chooched. We have the hoses in, checked for leaks already, pressurized the lines, thank you uh, sprinkler valves. Hose just chooching in there, but it exits from the other side of the machine instead of this side. So that means it's gonna be shorter and uh, I have to figure out how the fuck I'm gonna do this. I think I have a good idea of what I'm gonna do, but uh, it's gonna suck because I have to put an air vent on it and it's I don't really have the right stuff for it. It's in there in that mess because I had to move everything for this on account of, you know, I had the chooch in the sink there. But uh, it's here. Again, I don't know why the damn knob is black. I think that's something with the failed Italian or something, I don't know. And I think it is definitely a smaller capacity machine. It just looks smaller. I have the cap upstairs, that's another story altogether. I gotta clean it up, obviously, but we did run a chooch off of it. I just plugged it in temporarily, located it over there as a test on account of the cord doesn't reach over there just yet because it ain't back to the wall, so that's that. Now once I get it back there, we have to see where it has to sit because the cover may not be able to go up because it might hit into the, uh, the gauge. And if it does, then... Uh, whatever but I just learned that I got a quarter off I you know a quarter off the house because I found that under there and it wasn't there so that means that uh, it was a quarter less and there's all kinds of goodies down there I'm gonna have to clean up I don't even know I don't know it's not happy looking stuff I know that certainly not but the machine was leaking oil for ages, so probably a lot of that's oil and shit like that. But anyways, here we did do a test chooch on it, no leaks, everything seems to work, but I do have to work out this damn drain because, uh, again, I need to put an air vent on it and uh, clean the whole fucking thing up. It's got shit all over it, whatever, can't even scrape it, it's just, everything's just fucking beat to hell. But it's here, and this has got shit all over it, so I gotta do a whole clean and wax job and all kinds of shit on it. It's a much simpler machine than I wanted. It doesn't have extra knobs and features I don't need. You know, it's only small, medium, and large instead of like, you know, uh, extra large, super large, extra small, like the other one has. And this is fine, you know, three controls, I mean, because they don't have the warm, warm anymore. Or the hot warm, you know, God forbid. But this does have a soak feature. Now, I didn't give it a uh, test to see, because it looks like you start it there, it goes for 20 minutes, and it shuts off. Now, if we're intelligent, it would do that and then start the next wash. So why would it say off? Because it actually turns off, and then you have to remember to come down in 20, it's not much of a soak feature, I could just tell it, forget it, and uh, leave the lid open and whatever. But this machine is actually older, and it will actually agitate with the cover open, even though, like I said, everything's just filthy and knackered, and I gotta fix this fucking thing, because it's all loose and that. I'm just gonna uh, probably just hot glue it. That should hold it fine. Probably hot glue, double stick tape, something like that. <clears throat> and that'll hold it good. I was gonna put a screw and a little nut and bolt, but there's just no damn need. Oh, that's good. Using too little detergent is a common cause of laundry problems. I have to remember to use more detergent. I have more detergent. I have more detergent. It, it does say more. So I have more detergent. 
I mean, I have more detergent. So, anyway, and then, uh, oh, oh, we got a problem. I gotta go. I gotta, oh, actually, let's go, son of a bitch. I'll make another video. What had happened was I left my, um, the, the, I got the asthma. Uh -huh. and I left the, I left the asthma uh, pump down um, somewhere around here. Okay, so you gotta go find it now. Yeah. The, the asthma. And how, how far, how far home did you get? I, I got to Sunrise Highway. Oh, you did? Yeah, and I was like, uh, are you recording this still? Yes. <laughs> There's not enough light to see anything, but. Oh, thank goodness. <laughs> so you can't see me actually. Chooching around, looking. Maybe I left it out here. Matt left his cigarettes, ha ha. Matt left his cigarettes. Mine now. <laughs> so I'm assuming I left them downstairs. Could be. Could be. So, still. So Shad. Failed again? Oh, but see, what had happened was. That's it. I, I was, I'm, I'm good. <laughs> remember where I put important things like things I need to breathe and all that. <clears throat> yeah, I mean, why would you actually need that? Exactly. Maybe you lost it and it's like gone now. I know not. Yeah, I don't know. It's not in the washing machine, I know that. <laughs> Why, you were just talking to the water? Machine? Yeah, I was. I was just making the videos. <laughs> so you lost it now. And you came all the way back for nothing. I came all the way back for nothing. Because he doesn't know. I'm such an idiot. But you don't need your allergy medication at home. Well, see what happened. That was, I left that at home because that was in my, my bug out bag and I, uh, what the fuck is this guy talking about? Here, I'm <laughs> just right, fucking so I, knackered this guy. So I'm assuming it's not here. I don't know where you left it. So if you find it, you find it. Okay. If I find it, I find it. If not, I'll get one by the job tomorrow. I guess, uh, whatever. Yeah, see. That's next time at Jay's Bar. Alrighty, so so now he's gonna leave now. So he's leaving now. I'm assuming I'm leaving now. All right. Hopefully I'll find it. <laughs> All right. Take care. Later, guys. Later. All right, that was completely unplanned. While he was uh, explaining, is we have all this stuff in there and up here. And what it is, is from the cracks on the, uh, the stairs, because the wood rubs up against each other. And I had put duct tape there, but I should have wrapped it around. For some reason, it didn't seem like a good idea to do that at the time, so I just did that. And of course, it fell down because too much sawdust got on it, and it chooches all over everything. And that's real nice, but now that we had three people and a washing machine, on the stairs at the same time, which really aren't in the best of shape to begin with. Well, uh, I guess it kind of makes sense that that would happen. So now I gotta clean all that up in addition to everything else. Oh God. Yeah, this drain is not gonna be fun. I have other parts here for the uh, anti-siphon on it. And there's supposed to be a hose at the bottom of that one on the right, but uh, that apparently fell in the sump bucket underneath. I don't know. I don't know anymore. So I'll have to play with it all tomorrow. So this is going to be my project for tomorrow. See what the hell is going on. But anyway, it is down here. I can wiggle it back to the wall. It's not a big deal. And yeah, that'll definitely clear the and the camera makes it look, you know, much, much bigger dif distance, beg my pardon, but it'll fit under there, certainly. They should all be a standard height for the most part. In fact, this comes, that's about even, 
as is that, so it's all the same height. Funny how the camera like really, yeah, really uh, exacerbates that. But anyway, uh, we're rambling and it's Chase Bar after hours and I gotta just shut things off over there and that's that. Oh, I also had to change the light over here because the, the bulb just had it and uh, all I had handy was a warm white but it adds a uh, charmy elegance to this little area here. So I think I'll leave it. I don't know where the hell I'll ever find another one if I need it, but uh, it is warm white and uh, whatever. So it looks kind of nice and whatever. Anyway, that's that for that. And everything's dickered and uh, I'll probably make some more videos tomorrow once I get everything chooch in here. And that's that. So have a good evening.